Tomorrow, a major hotel project will go before the city council. If approved, a 21-story hotel would be built at the site on the corner of Canal and Chapatula Streets. But it's what it would replace that has preservationists to the mayor speaking out against the proposed development. WDSU reporter Andy Cunningham live on Canal Street with more on what they're calling, Andy, a growing controversy. That's right, Camille, and that property sits directly behind me here at the intersection of Canal and Chapatula Streets, always a hub of activity, and currently home, the corner, I should say, is home to four historical buildings that house a variety of businesses. The owner of this block wants to demolish those buildings to make room for a 21-story hotel that the project's developer says would spur some much-needed economic development by creating 300 new permanent jobs at almost 400 hotel rooms and help fuel the city's biggest and fastest growing industry, tourism, while offering a modern architectural landmark in one of the city's most iconic corridors. Preservationists, though, along with opponents that include the mayor, believe the owner should rehabilitate the site and preserve those historic structures. To sacrifice historic buildings for a hotel is not the way to go. Visitors come here because we are a unique city. Every, every city needs to protect its own identity. If I'm a, a business traveler, a conventioner, or just a tourist, I will interact with this corner. And so I see this as a landmark site that deserves an iconic building. Two very different views there, and already the CBD Historic Landmarks Commission denied the project's permit to demolish these buildings. So now the developer and owner will go before the city council tomorrow afternoon for reconsideration. Reporting live from Canal Street, I'm Andy Cunningham. Back to you.